لورد رابین کوربت رئیس لوردهای حزب حاکم کارگر در مجلس عیان و رئیس گروه پارلمانی ایران آزاد در مجلس انگلستان گفت سلام سلام اشرف سلام ایران I bring you greetings from my colleagues and myself down here on behalf of the majority of members of the British Parliament and around 200 members of the House of Lords and declare our strong support for the people of Iran and their resistance movement which is determined to win freedom and democracy. As, as we mourn those murdered this week by the Mullah's thugs, we should also remember the 120,000 members of the resistance slaughtered since 1981, especially those 30,000 political prisoners killed in the single year of 1988, when Mosavi was the Prime Minister, by the way. I want you to listen. Please listen. If you listen, You will hear the demands of the people of Ashraf for freedom and democracy echo across the towns and cities of Iran. As they cry freedom, marching millions demand UN-supervised elections, <clears throat> an end to the Mullah's dictatorship, and insisting upon the sovereignty of the people. And just as in Ashraf, men and women are equal, women have marched and shouted alongside their brothers, fathers and husbands on the streets of Tehran, Mashhad, Qom, Isfahan, Tabriz and dozens of other towns. We especially salute those brave women, despised as second-class citizens by the mullahs, now standing up for freedom. <laughs> The way ahead for the people of Iran who cry freedom is neither appeasement nor military intervention. It is democracy, the very thing for which the mullahs this week have shown such brutal contempt. <clears throat> 